Hey guys, it's Richie. I'm here at Patoon Tawny Speedway for DC Drift and the S9 truck meet. Check out this Sapiro. I like the cat livery on it. It's pretty funny. And you got the other car on the team over here. It's also got a crazy cat livery. It's hilarious. These cars look really cool. Looks like these guys are doing a transmission swap. Here's a cool drift car with a 1UZ swap, twin turbo. That's awesome. Here's a Wise car. It's got a 2JZ in it. Oh, here's a crash drift car. Damn. Look at this flatbed tow truck over here. So this is one of the slide back trucks. So this bed slides down and lays flat on the ground so you can roll lowered cars onto it a lot easier. But it's also just a much smaller package than a lot of the tow trucks that we have at home. I think it looks kind of neat. Like the mirrors on this automatically pivot like when it parks it folds them in it's pretty cool oh here we go this kind of shows how this works like he's already picked the car up a little bit i think but it's it's a lot lower than the ramp trucks that we have at home so this is the only drift car at this event with an ls engine in it one of the slide trucks with the E36 on it. Here goes another one. The piping on this thing is insane. He's got all the 
all the airbrushing to show the hot side and the cold side. There's all this titanium. It's, and it's all pie cuts. Like it's crazy. Look at this little Toyota pickup. It's got this crazy engine in it. The CNC valve cover. That valve cover looks really nice. I'm not sure if this is a Toyota engine or an Isuzu engine. I can't tell the difference between the diesels. I just don't know about them enough. This guy's got some real nice intercooler piping. Oh, oh. A sheet metal intake manifold. That's really cool. It's another Toyota pickup with a V6 badge on it for some reason, even though it's a diesel. But he's got a clear hood. That's pretty cool. Look at this Jaguar. Not really sure why this is at a truck meet. But it's pretty unusual to see here. There's not a whole lot of Jags. So here's a bunch of pickups that are part of the Bacon Truck Club. It's a pretty big club here in Thailand. And they're all heavily modified. And they do these cool murals under the hood. This truck is really cool. It's got this Chucky painting on the bottom. And it's got all this titanium piping and radiator support cover. And we got models. This red one's pretty cool with the demon painting on the bottom, but then it's more work truck style with the whatever this thing is in the bed. I don't even know what to call it. There's some more bacon trucks. This one's red. This Hello Kitty one's pretty cute. It's got some nice pipe work going on. Oh, this one's a Toyota. I thought they all had Isuzu's. The mods on this one are pretty crazy. Like, where'd the radiator go? But look at all this crazy pipe work. CNC valve cover. They do a lot of crazy machine work for these and a lot of custom pipe work. Like I think the radiator is probably in the bed. Let's take a look. It's got a nitrous bottle inside of it. More titanium work back here. It's got two more nitrous bottles. It's got the tailgate. I'm not seeing a radiator. Sometimes they put the radiators under the bed or like under the truck somewhere. It's pretty crazy. I like this pink and carbon fiber one. It looks pretty cool. It's also got the black uh, aluminum intercooler piping, sheet metal intake manifold, lots of machined aluminum parts on it. Like all the pulleys, looks pretty good. And a uh, big boar painting. Oh, and look at what the pink one's hauling around. A couple nitrous bottles but a race bike. That's pretty awesome. So you can still use these trucks as trucks. And it's also got Hello Kitty on the tailgate. That's pretty funny. This bike looks really cool too. It's got an Olin's shock on it. Some crazy exhaust pipe. Oh, it's a two stroke, so it's got a big expansion pipe on it. A nice uh, CNC machined cylinder head. That's really cool. I bet this thing's fast. This green one looks pretty nice too. It's got the titanium uh, emblem thing on it. It's got a lot of work done to the engine. Oh, I just noticed that this green one's got nitrous bottles in the back of it. Like the other one. Look, it's got the Hulk laser etched on it and the turbo. That's pretty cool. And a clear tailgate. Oh, look at this. There's a Lamborghini at the truck show. 
This is a pretty cool color on it. That's awesome. Here's something real unusual to see here. A Dodge Neon. What the hell? It's got a bunch of gauges on the dash too. Crazy. Oh, I like this little orange Toyota pickup. Look, it's got a Jay-Z engine in it. It's a big turbo. That looks really cool. Look how big the intercooler is on this thing. I like the gold heat reflecting tape between the welds on this charge pipe. That's pretty interesting. And on the throttle body, but not on anything else. Look at this. It's got some Smarco seats inside of it. Whoa, look at this Suzuki carry. And look at what it's carrying. A heavily modified Honda Dax. Look, it's got Pirelli slicks on it. It's got some custom exhaust. Let's go around the other side. Oh, here's the tailgate. That looks pretty nice. But look at this thing. It's got a Yoshimura exhaust. And it's, got, and it's got some intake thing right here. The fender, this right here, is uh, carbon fiber. I don't know if the seat is stock or not. It's got a little rack. It's got Olin's uh, suspension. Or at least rear suspension. That looks pretty cool. Look at this off-roader Toyota pickup. This thing looks sweet. But it's way too clean. <laughs> Look at all the gear that they jammed in the back of it. That's awesome. I like the aluminum tray. And then they got a shovel right here. That's pretty cool. And this wouldn't be a Thai car show without models. little Mazda Demio or Mazda 2 is pretty cool. It's got an interesting license plate. I don't think I've seen one of these before. It's got some nice wheels on it. It says Demio all-wheel drive. Do they make these in all-wheel drive now or did someone just slap a badge on it? Just two guys just decide to start drag racing each other. So here's the announcer guys. They're just walking around with a speaker on wheels now. The noise is endless. That was the S9 truck show. If you guys liked the video, comment and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.